this is the first time using this microphone. Um, that is, of course, this might not upload though before it begins to run down. I don't even know if this will be uploaded. Don't know why I'm saying that because if it is, you're seeing it. If not, I'm probably seeing it just myself. Uh, got some things weighing heavy on me. I feel like we all have this sometimes. By the way, really quickly, do want to say shout out to my mom for the microphone and shout out to Logan, my brother, for um, letting me have it because he didn't need it. So, I really just want to start off by saying I'm really fine mentally of where I am with this. I have been dealing with it for 16 years, technically. And with all of this mentioned, uh, I just want to be loved. And it seems more like a sadder video and all of this. But I'm just sitting here trying to do my geometry homework, which is so difficult. My brain starts to freaking just get so hurt by it. And it's like, there's so many people out there. Who you see every single day, right? And then you're like, okay, they're pretty, they're whatever, you know? And, um, but there's those few people that you just feel like you really missed because you can't re really get that relationship because you just, they're like the most beautiful thing, right? And you're like, wow, you regret it. And regret something that hurts. Regret is something that I don't like to have often. I don't have often in general. But with regret being a thing of what it is, um, I do regret certain things. But not with just the females. They look just absolutely beautiful, which I think she does. I'm not going to mention names. But also just who she is. And who a lot of girls are that I messed up on. Because I like girls at this point, and I have since about late 6th grade, um, for who they are deep down. And for some reason, I don't know if I get that same treatment back. Uh, that's what I personally view. Now, I'm not looking for any pity or anything. I'm just really sitting here. And thinking, like, I just want something authentic, you know, like, I mean, love seems like a great thing. Like, I'm already loved by a lot of people, family members, friends, um, people who are basically family members that are friends, um, you know, Tyler Miles. But I'm talking, obviously, about a other gender, you know, ro a romantic love. And love's a weird thing for me. Uh, heck, I don't even know how good I do in a relationship, obviously never been in one, and all this, but, whenever people ask me now, like, oh, what do you want from a relationship, what do you look for in a girl, you know, what kind of girls do you go after, any girl that'll love me, any girl that'll accept me for who I am, because at this point, that's where I am, I'm not trying to get no perfect relationship, I'm not trying to get no anything, because I've tried that. And I realized that I can't truly get that. This is more of an in-depth look of how I really feel about my status. When it comes to relationships, people always ask me, people always wonder, wow, how can you do that? Because some of you guys out there, you know, you are in relationships every week, sometimes every other month, sometimes maybe it's every like six months. Sometimes you just had your first big um, major relationship, but for me, I just haven't gotten it yet, and I guess it's a waiting game, because at this point, I don't want to get hurt again, and uh, I don't really want to burn any more bridges, because every time I burn a bridge, I look back, and I feel regret about it, um, I would just like to say, it's a tough video to make. Like, after it, I might cry a little bit. But I ain't doing it on video. Um.
But actually, this is to prevent me from crying. Actually, so hopefully I don't do it afterwards. Maybe like one tear. Because um, I was about to. And I was like, screw it. I will record and make a video for y'all. Um, because this is just true to who I am. And this is something that I know if I'm feeling it. I know some of y'all just want this authentic love. I know most people do. And, you know, we're in high school. I'm a sophomore. What more do I expect? Um, I don't know. Uh, I guess sometimes I just aim too high. Uh, yeah. When's it gonna happen? I don't know. Um, probably not sophomore year. Most likely junior year. Um, I don't even know. You know, I don't got game. I don't got drip. I don't got looks. Um... Only thing I really got is personality. That can only take you so far. If I would majorly have looks and then not personality, I think I could get farther. But it's okay. Someday when I do obtain the love. I probably won't be one of the happiest people on earth. Mark my words. <laughs> no, you don't need to, but... Yeah, sorry if this is a little bit of a sadder video. But, it's just the truth. Uh, I don't know if the microphone picks up Daisy licking herself. Because she's been doing it like the whole time. But, if it does, I'm sorry. If it doesn't, whatever. Um... Alright. All I gotta say. Is. Um, beautiful inside and out. I just gotta be focusing. That I don't miss another opportunity. Like I did that one. But I can't live in fear. I must live in now. So my time to change is now. Get drip. Be all more confident, you know. Really just be a new person to myself. And it's going to take a while of just staying out. And I was really not trying to look at girls like this. But man, when you look at them and they are just so beautiful, it's really hard to not talk about. Because it weighs heavy. That's my thoughts on love and relationships. Personally. Love y'all. And until next time when I see you again. Yo, yo, I fuck. Ouch.